So this winter during lockdown, like everybody else, I got very bored and got myself a little off-road bike. Um, I've always fancied a 300 two-stroke and so I thought I'd go for it this time. Now, I spent a lot of time looking and wanted particularly to get a, a carburetor bike because um, I didn't fancy the new injection. It seems a little bit over complicated for me for, for an enduro bike. So I ended up with this 2016, 2017 Husqvarna 300. Uh, and I must say I'm really really pleased with it. it. It's really interesting because you imagine that a 300 two-stroke is going to be an absolute savage beast but actually it's a pussycat and it, it's beautiful because it pulls off the bottom and hopefully when I'll put some of the riding clips on in a minute you can see that you can roll along in sort of second or third gear at almost tick over, crack the throttle and it'll lift the front wheel so it carries you through those bogs and over the big puddles and over the obstacles and stuff and actually makes it very easy for an amateur like me really um, to ride and, and, and feel good and it's, it's, it's very very light, it's very easy, it's lovely soft power um, you've got the map switch so you can liven it up a little bit if you need to but I, I must say I'm really really pleased with it, I'm having lots of fun it, it starts, rides, runs easy and um, it just makes enduro riding a, a lot of fun and um, you, you know, I'd never had a Hassan before, always KTM as you can see by the orange kit and I couldn't find a KTM that I wanted um, and so I ended up with this Husky and, and I must say for the money it costs what an amazing piece of kit and what, what a whole load of fun that can be had. Um, you know, the, the Huskies differ slightly from the KTMs in the fact they've got a linkage rear end um, so you've got a rising rate suspension like a road bike as opposed to a direct link push on the um, KTMs um, and like I say, this is last of the carburetor bikes, which which was important to me. Um, equally, there are things you can do to change the power delivery. There are, there are different springs on the um, power valve unit. This has got the medium spring in it, which I find fine. Um, but you can actually soften or sharpen the power as you need to, um, if, if you're a better rider than me, I guess. Um, but I, I, in sort of standard medium setting, I find this absolutely fantastic. and. Um, really really enjoyable to ride and look forward to getting it out down to Wales and things when the lockdown lifts maybe doing a couple of enduros I'm going to go at the Welsh two day I've always fancied um, and I just just thought I'd kind of share it with you what I've been up to while we're off the road bikes <laughs> Yeah. 